Today we're going over Hossum's customer service and that's coming up next here on Jesse B Motors. Don't forget if you like videos like this, like, share, and subscribe, hit that notification bell and leave a comment down below. So what we're going to talk about today is Hossum's customer service here. In my last video, you guys saw I was doing a review on this and it broke. And I got a hold of Hossum and told them what happened. They watched the video and everything. And they end up sending me for free some parts here, which I'm very happy about. So what we're going to do is, is open these packages up here real quick and see what's in them. And then we're going to get this all fixed up. So let's see what we got in the package here. Make sure we got everything we need to get this thing back up and going. Get it opened up here. Package is a little bit hard to get open. Got that one opened up. Let's see what was in this one here. Get it to come out. This one looks like we have our new wheel nuts here in this package. We'll get the other one opened up here. And see what's in this one. And in this one we have our new pins and wheel nuts. So we got everything to get this back together. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, guys, since I had everything new here, I figured I'd check everything to make sure that everything was all right. And lo and behold, I took the rear wheel off and that pin is in three pieces too and it fell apart like that. Now I had people get on me in the original video, it was my fault that this front one broke. You wanna tell me why it's my fault for this one too? So I wanna turn this around here. And we are going to check every single one of these to see how these are. I was wondering if the four-wheel drive was working right. So we're going to take this wheel off here. Okay, that pin fell out, so that one's still good. Let's check this rear one here. I just want to check these and make sure they're all good since I got all new pieces. All right. And we'll take this one off. Now the ones on this side are perfectly fine, but the ones on the other side, both sides were broke like that. Not too impressed with that. Possum, I think you need to make a little bit bigger cross pins in here. Now I'm not trying to be mean or anything. I'm just trying to get you guys to improve on your product. Now I'm going to get the rest of this installed. Now this time around, I'm using blue Loctite, and I'm going to put that on all of the threads on these to make sure that the wheel nuts do not come off. All right, everybody, now I'm a little upset here. Here's the pin that originally comes with it. Here's the pin they sent me. You can see an obvious difference in that. That one is way bigger than that one, and that one will not fit into the hole on here. So I'm not real happy about this. This pin they sent me is what they should originally use so it don't break under torque instead of this little dinky thing. So now I'm going to have to figure out something for a pin here. I'll probably find a nail or something and cut it myself and get this thing back together. All right, everyone. I went through my parts box and I found two pins that'll work. But now I got another issue. The hex nuts they sent, these don't fit either. Not only were the pins wrong, the hex nuts are wrong. I cannot win with this RC, guys. So I'm going to tell you my final thoughts on this whole situation. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to go through my parts bin, see if I can find any uh, hex nuts here that will work with this. If not, I might go back to that railroad track and see if I can find the one that flew off. But I just, I want to be honest here. Hossum did a great job at getting me the parts and stuff. They were really cool. I got a hold of them. They said, yeah, we'll send them out. A few days later, the parts show up. You know, A plus for that, Hossum. I give you credit for that. It's just really aggravating when the parts are wrong. I don't know who, but somebody dropped the ball on this. And I, I don't really want to hold that against them, but that's just not right because now... I got to use my own parts to fix this and everything. So hopefully if Awesome sees this, 
I want them to know I have nothing against you or your company or anything. I have uh, reviewed other Hossum RCs that I had before that I got off of Amazon and I really enjoyed them and I had a blast with them. This one on the other hand, <laughs> this one is a lemon. Other people have had good luck with them, but mine is a lemon. So this will probably be the last video you guys see on this because I'm going to get it back together and I'll probably end up selling it or something. I'm not going to keep it. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Leave a comment down below and we'll see you all on the next one.